Whoa! Uh, I just found a new game called Plagues, and I'm infecting Plague Inc. And then I'm infecting the world with my disease that I have formally named, officially got it certified, Boners. And it started in Asia, and everyone's infected Southeast with boners. Asia. South, Southeast Asia, everyone's infected with boners. And it's growing exponentially. Exponentially. People are dying from boners. This is fucking disgusting. Diet right zero? Yeah. Water? Fingers are cold. <laughs> we haven't vlogged in forever. Uh, catch up time, catch up time. They're warm now. Okay. What are, we, what are we catching up on? I don't know. Play guitar. <laughs> Tell them what Wesley did in the drive through That's a long story, though. We have time. Okay, so... <clears throat> Wesley works at McDonald's. And on the night shifts, there's not that many people there. And, like, four people tops. He was... Let me get closer. I'm not holding it. I can't hold it. Distance. <clears throat> he was in the what they call the hole, which is when you work the first window and they all had headsets on and there was this guy working up front named Kyle. He decided, hey, I'm going to fuck with Kyle. So every now and then he just whisper, Kyle. And just get real quiet. And the guy started fucking freaking out. He was yelling at everybody. He's like, is somebody fucking whispering my name? And Wesley was the only one that knew what was going on. So they're like, no, man, nothing's going on. And one of the other guys got in on it. So they're just both like, Kyle, Kyle. It was... What's a hoopla? <laughs> that still makes me chuckle. Put the chicken in your ass. Went free running at Smothers Park the other day. Yeah, I got hurt. Twisted my ankle into my butt. My foot didn't even bend. It just went straight from ankle to knee. They just like passed each other in some weird vibration motion straight into my butt from the side. Side note, the fountain at that park is beautiful at night. It was pretty. The acoustics were awesome in the seashell of death. Sarah got me some paracord. So if I ever get in a survival situation, I can parachute or play a chord. Either or. I, I don't want to die unhappy. I can be happy now. There's a saltine in the ashtray. It's Preston's guitar. Look, guitar. Look, angel butt. Look at angel butt. That's not an angel, it's a cherub. It's a cherub. It's a baby angel. That's just my eyes. so tired. We checked our paychecks. Um, we got paid nothing. We got screwed over. We got screwed over so bad in our hour. Due to next week's my 13 hour week. Well, you work two days? <laughs> I work two days. It's more like one and a half days. That sucks. My, my schedule actually starts to bounce back out a little bit next week. Yeah. So we're going to get paid nothing. I'm probably going to get fired. I. With dignity. And pride. I'm off three days this week. I'm only supposed to be off two. And they're like, hey, you're going to be off Friday. And I was like, okay. So, I mean, I only, got, I only worked like 25 hours this week. Which is a big cut from I usually work like 36. Minimum. On a side note, did you know that caterpillars when they go into their cocoon cocoon is it pupa vulva it's not vulva, <laughs> it's, not vulva. <laughs> it's not vulva it's a clitoris <laughs> they're they're little pupa caterpie things they're cocoons their uh their bodies melt basically into a big puddle of enzymes and stuff as a, as a butterfly. and then over time they just rebuild out of this liquid into a butterfly or a moth. 
Do moth? Do moths moth do that too? Or is it just butterflies? I know it's butterflies. I don't know about moths. Those are probably just like Satan comes in the middle of the liquid and he just starts laughing and then they turn into really disgusting. Well, there's a moth flying around here somewhere. When you that are moths. That moth isn't around here anymore because you burnt him multiple times. <laughs> He landed on me. I don't like fucking moths landing on me, dude. Mm. Oh, we've been running this while. We didn't even say anything. Yeah, we um, have. my hands up, dog. Uh, blah, blah, blah. uh so shiny what, watch. What flavors do they have for you to select from at the Buka Bar? I really couldn't help you there. I hope it's not ball sack. <laughs> <laughs> it's definitely ball sack. Oh my god. Oh yeah, we have a nice selection tonight at the hookah bar. <laughs> you can choose from um, we got we got ball sack, we got a uh, scrotum fire. That's a, that's a popular one. Um, and flame testes, which is kind of like scrotum fire, but it's a little it's more southern, more of a southern tradition. And monkey anus. And then peach. But I but the peach. Oh, sorry, we're out of peach. The, the peach is kind of gross. The rest of them are pretty good. I'd like peach. We're on a peach. I want to leave. Oh, baby, this is Hotel California. <laughs> you can check out any time you like. But you may never leave. I am still drinking this. <laughs> There's also Taint Rocket. <laughs> <laughs> Gooch missile. Erect Nation. I love water. I was going to say something, but it's gone. Um, well, this guy walked up to me the other day. Okay. So this guy walked up to me the other day, and I'm just minding my own business. That's your foot. That's my toesies. That's your toesies. These are my feet. Guy walks up to me, I'm just minding my own business, and he just pulls his pants down. I'm in, I'm in, I was at Costco in the parking lot. Guy just pulls his pants down, and just takes a big shit right in the middle of the Costco parking lot. And I'm like, dude, this isn't Home Depot, you can't just shit in the fucking parking lot. He's like, dude, I can do whatever I want. And, I was, and then I woke up. See, you didn't have me at all. I've never seen a Costco. So I was kind of questioning this from the beginning. Yeah. And then I realized he's not me, so he could go places. He didn't go places. I never go anywhere. He's got his baby here. She's adorable, laying down. She's she, asleep. She's not allowed to eat ice cream. She's not allowed. There's too much sugar. I was told that's a bad idea by multiple sources. Yeah. I mean, she can have a little niblet of vanilla ice cream, but anything other than that, no. I, I like her to be able to take naps so she's not, you know, insanely angry all day. That's what beaver tranquilizers are for. No, you can't. That's not legal. No. Uh, alright, we've been talking a while. Texas is south. I don't know how to end it, so... We can end this is my nose. Why don't we just give them our address and our social security numbers, too? I didn't tell them that. Probably not. Watch me get all these Nigerian clients again. I put up Craigslist stuff, and apparently everybody from Nigeria wants my stuff. Wants to sell you their stuff. They don't even want to sell me. They just want to pay $400 for something that's like 12 And I'm like, wait a second. This sounds too good to be true. It might have been. I don't know. I just can't ship out of the country. I don't. I don't know how to put addresses I mean, down like that. How many stamps do you need to even do that? I don't. You probably have to go like buy their stamps. I don't want to buy Nigerian stamps. And then like tape a penny to the box, and then make the paper out of aluminum foil. Just get one of those flat rate boxes if it if it's the chips. But my products aren't flat. They're not. 
With flat rate boxes. So they're rated for flat boxes. Um, 